Yo, what's going on guys? I know it's been a long time since I've uh, turned on my face cam for a YouTube video. I actually do not remember the last one. Maybe it was like a Twitch highlight or something. I don't know. However, um, it's that time of the year now where we throw money at the dead game. I mean, um, Grand Blue Fantasy. <laughs> it's game's not dead. It's just, this is the slow portion of the year around like September to around December. Um, it's kind of slow, so uh, might be a little dead. Might not be, <laughs> but I'm still playing the games in case people think I like disappear. I, I'm, I disappear because I get burnt out, so it happens to the best of us. You know, if you've been playing the same gear for what now, like four years, you know, you're bound to get eventually burnt out. And I get burnt out like every year eventually, um, like every nine months, 10 months. You know, you grind so much, right? It's, it's kind of it hurts. <laughs> you need a break from this game. Honestly, it's unhealthy if you play this game nonstop. So I take breaks all the time. Um, my current break is going to be me playing Genshin Impact. Um, that's like another mobile game. Well, it's like mobile console games, kind of weird, but that's going to be my big thing. If you want to follow me, I'll be streaming that on Twitch. I'll probably no life it as much as I can. We'll see. Anyways, down to spending money in Grand Blue. Let me change my game to English, actually, because um, I don't remember each weapon name, but we could talk about each weapon, what we're going to go for. So currently we have three options here, fire, water, earth, wind, light, dark. This is the same match limit break gotcha we got the last two times. Not much had changed. I think a couple of new characters are in here now, like Noise. Um, I think Noise and Ilnot, right? Are the no, I think Ilnot was in the last one, but let's take a look at each set and I'll just go over my opinions on it. So the first raid is normal. Like this is the normal gotcha stuff, rate one and two. Um, three and four is the special stuff that this um, scam gotcha gives. So for here, personally, what I'm going for is gotcha freed. Um, I can use a second copy of it, just so you know, it does come with, uh, I forgot the name of the skill, but it's like 50% CA damage cap up, caps out at 30 in grid, so you can run two in grid. I do have one right now, so if I get another, pretty cool. Then we have Gangsta Knife, still a decent weapon. Um, I currently have two. So if I get a third copy, it's like, eh, I don't really want it, but I kind of still use it, I think. Not really, I'm not too sure. Three Gangsta Knives is a lot of no attack mods. You get a Medi, but no attack mods, so. Depends. Lily Staff is a hard nope, um, <laughs> in my opinion. It's, it's just the character, so if you don't have Lily, it's good. But her weapon, eh, I mean, it's... It's been used in higher difficulty content because it has a really high HP mod. But other than that, it's kind of like, ah. Here we have Elnot's weapon. Um, I actually don't know what this weapon does. I don't even have the character, so this is a big one for me. So that's three things I'm happy to get right here. Um, hopefully I get her. Then we have Meliora's Acid Bow Shooter. I have no clue what this weapon does either off the top of my head. Um, this is another item I can use because I don't have this character. Meteora. Uh, I, I already have like three filament breaks, so I don't really want this. I don't have Summer Kalulu, so I can't even meme if I get the fourth copy with like the gun and grid, but hey, who knows? Don't need this, and Metal Destroyer is still a good weapon. I don't have one filament break, so. Uh, that's for me. It's, this is. Probably the most value for me. I have one, two, three, four, five options here. Personally, um, I think most of these are pretty good. So, fire and water is probably the one you probably want to go with. Just purely on the quality, but we'll look at the other LEs just in case. So, here we have oh, that would have been bad. We have earth and wind. Earth and wind is kind of. Yeah, great swords. It's still a good weapon for Titan builds. It kind of used the magnet sometimes, but um, mainly tie in. Petra's weapon is garbage, and so it's her character. Bal is a decent character, but his weapon I don't think it's that great. I don't remember what it does at the top of my head. I'm sorry if I don't remember each weapon at the top of my head. The gotcha weapons are a lot more niche 
so they're not used as commonly. So they remember their weapon skills and stuff. It's kind of hard, but I'm pretty sure no one uses bow weapon. I think I have a full limit break already too. Shredder Mind is still a decent weapon, um, mainly for harder content because Titan is so defensive. This weapon you don't really use it in most content unless it's like Fa, maybe Bubs, but mostly Fa because you take the initial damage. Uses himself as a character though, it's pretty bad. So we, right now, you, for like this one, you have two really bad characters being Petra and Eustace. While Eustace does have a good gun, the characters themselves are pretty bad, and then this one's pretty bad too, so that's three pretty bad characters. Bal is a good character in my opinion. He does have a pretty nice kit, the, um, the spell and the stackables. Air Bandages, this is really only gonna benefit Titan, so it's a good weapon. It's, the best garrison weapon you can get that's not 100 gold moons so the claw is actually pretty good too for primal win but who plays primal win in 2020 other than like 10 people myself included <laughs> uh noise is a new character i actually don't know what his boats does i actually just ended up pulling him from the um the what that scam thing we had not the scam the treasure chest thing i ended up pulling him from that that was pretty cool. We have another Sky here, which is a good weapon. So Vera herself being a good character too. So we have, this one's okay, I think. You have one decent character being Vera. Noise is pretty decent. Um, Bal is decent. Ayer's okay. He more of death fodder now, 2020, so. And the rest of the character's pretty eh. And then the weapons are really just another Sky, Claw, Bandits and Stratomizer. Great sword too, I guess. But I mean, Great Sword has a um, free weapon equivalent, so. It's pretty pretty niche. If you want to go boss to the wall, um, it's okay, I suppose. And here we go, we're back here again. Fairy weapon. Not really used unless you have like no health and you want to do far high level and you're desperate to throw it in grid. Like me. <laughs> I think I used one of these in my Fa solo because I had no health. It was, I was desperate. Graham is a okay weapon. I only really used Graham for Grand Order high level. So kind of niche. I don't really recommend it personally. Bayer herself is not that great either as a character. Um, Spectral Cleaver, it's kind of like the Claw from Primal Wind. So... It's okay, I suppose, but mm, not something I would recommend going after. Um, Vate Bloody Scar is still used pretty well. Um, Vate himself, not so much. The, the weapon is pretty good. So this, so you have one good weapon here. Graham is a decent weapon if you're doing Grand Order high level. Um, that's two decent weapons here. Tanya herself, her weapon's okay, but it's the free to play Anubis weapon. Pretty much the same thing. This has. A large attack mod, Anubis has medium. So her weapon's pretty niche. It's usable though. I use I use it personally, but it's niche. Like it's you can use the free-to-play option. Vagabond's still a good weapon, so you do have Kalulu there. Um Silver Weapon's actually getting more use now. So this is actually a really big thing here because of people who have EO. This is a really, really big thing. And then Ruler of Fate's still a, a good Ogi weapon for Primal Light. And Magnolite too. Cause Magnolite has no way of getting cap up. So that's each of the weapons pretty much. Uh, uh, personally, I think I'm rolling on water and fire. Cause I get the most value out of it. Um, the other ones I pretty much have done already. So I'm not too worried about it. So let's get on to that really quick. Uh, it's always the fun part, spending the money. God, it sucks, dude. Don't play mobile games, by the way. Don't play mobile games. They're not worth, man. They are not worth. <sighs> Damn. Never winning, dude. Never winning. Wait, what? I got a new character. Oh. Joel, I think your name is? Joel. Yeah. Uh, you know, I'm not complaining. New character, surprise. You know, I was really hoping for that sunstone. Really hoping. 
Oh well. So here's the SSR guarantee. So our option here is. Oh shit, new character. I won. Whoa. Acid Bolt Shooter. I ain't complaining. New character. Someone I did not have before. So. Okay. That's worth to me. I'll take it. I ain't got no complaints here. Hey, pretty lucky. Um, tell me how you guys did if you did pull on this banner. Um, the scam gotcha that is. Personally, I'm happy what I got. I have no complaints. It's better than what I thought I was going to get. So, thank you guys for watching. As I mentioned, I will be playing Genshin for those who are interested in that game. I may post a video on it here and there. Who knows? But until then, uh, stay safe, boys, and peace out.